dab 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 I am bleeding dab 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 if you're a furry Fuck you We got a maid funny to constantly remind me of my mistake First of all, you need a sewing pattern. You can make easily make it yourself by just drawing the shapes and forms, pieces of the fox, I guess, onto a piece of paper. For pieces that have to be symmetrical, you can just fold the paper and, yeah, cut, draw only a half and only cut out and cut then everything together out. Now you gotta take your sewing pattern and a piece of material. I used an old orange shirt for my orange fox, but you can use like a blanket for that you bought for it or just some fleece material, yeah. Uh, so you gotta place it there and then you can just like follow around with chalk or... or well, <laughs> At some point I just gave up and used a marker. You can use that, just just that is visible to you. And yeah, then then after you gave up, yes, you used a marker. I am so good at explaining. And pin it on with these little pin needle things there and cut it out. Do that with every piece and you got your little base. And now we come to the actual sewing part. Just take a piece, take your needle with uh, and, and sew. Yes. Important is that you leave a little hole every in every single piece so you can turn it around to the kind of better looking side at the end. For the tail, I decided to turn it on the later on visible side and sew some white white material onto it, so, so it 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 so it can just look better at the end. Believe me, it look it looks good. It's a bit of work, but it looks good. Then just turn it around to the non-visible side when you're done and, and and sew it all together. Like, yeah. Now you gotta turn all the pieces around so you can so you have the better looking side for for edges you could you could use a a pencil or just like yeah I don't know be be a, be creative and now you only need your filling material to stuff it all up. 
after you stuff the pieces and closed up all the holes, you only have to sew every single piece together to get a fox. I actually wanted to record footage of how I did this, but I didn't press the record button. So there you go, a fox. A simple and bad tutorial by, by me, yes.